get our hands on this thing and see what we got. We definitely had them all around us. I'm talking literally all around us. How the emotions starting to set in. Unbelievable. The guy looked at him and said, good bear, take them. Down to the wire. This week on Double Lung Outdoors, we're going to be in Healy, Alaska, hunting with Coke Wallace. We actually made the trip last year. We were hunting moose. We uh, come off the hill. He was give or take 350. We wanted to get a little closer. Not that we didn't feel confident about the 50 caliber, but we got within 150, 200 yards, and I mean, I smoked him. This year, we're going to be hunting dial sheep in the Alaskan range. Jaron and I started out a couple of days ago. Well, no, actually yesterday started out of Dallas. Actually, Jaron started Sunday out of Ohio, got into Dallas. We picked him up Monday, and uh, here it is Wednesday evening. We're in Alaska. We're with Midnight's Sun Safaris, old Coke Wallace, Joe. We thought we might have a little bit of time to kind of do a couple of things, which we did take a little, uh, few minutes to shoot the gun in because Scotty, as soon as we hit the ground, he said, are y'all ready? So Jaron and I are fixing a pack up. We're gonna go probably on a four hour ride here, spock out in a, another camp, get ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow is opening morning of the sheep, and that's what we're here for. So uh, stay with us. You're watching Double Lung Outdoors here in Healy, Alaska with Coke Wallace. see kind of what we're doing now this is the first day here and unfortunate our guide has broke it to us that we are going to camp out for a few days you can see our cabin here to the right of us I think they said it's a hundred plus years old. And uh, it obvious, obviously looks like it. We're in for the night. We got here probably about an hour ago. Set the cots up. I'm gonna put three of them in here. Unfortunate, Scotty drew the short straw. He's gonna have to sleep outside tonight. They've got the horses tied off. Jaren's went down and got some water. But uh, it does look like we may be here for a day or two. We do have a lot of sheep in this area. Seen some coming in. We've seen a, a, a grizzly, seen about four or five uh, caribou coming in. It's uh, 1030 now. Scotty wants to get up here in a couple of hours, so uh, he thinks it's going to take us about two or three hours to get up on top. So he wants to try to get out of here about three o'clock in the morning. We don't like uh, far from being three, so uh, we're going to get ready, get settled in for the night. We're here in Healy, Alaska. We're going to be chasing uh, dial sheep. We uh, slept for a few hours uh, in this little Skinner shack here. So uh, we're up, we've had our oatmeal this morning, we've had a cup of hot coffee, and uh, we are uh, decided not to saddle the horses up. I think it's about, uh, give or take an hour to where we start up this ridge, it's in behind me here. So we got about three hours ahead of us to, uh, to the area where we're gonna stop, set up, start glassing for some sheep. Healy, Alaska, looking for a dial sheep. This segment is brought to you by RFJ Auto Partners Incorporated, Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, and Ram dealers, Dave Smith Motors, Kellogg, Idaho, Vernon Auto Group, Vernon, Texas, Trucktown Dodge, La Mesa, Texas, Sulphur Springs Dodge, Sulphur Springs, Texas, Greenville Chrysler, Greenville, Texas, Bonham Chrysler, Bonham, Texas, Academy Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, Bessemer, Alabama.